What's up, guys? So before we get the review going, man, just want to give a big shout out to my boy Dal Boone for helping me get the review done just a little bit faster, and also a big shout out to my boy Vanger Kiwi 56 for helping me get the Marcus Allen review done. I completely forgot to shout him out, man, but I'm shouting him out right here. So here we go. Campus here with Carlos Hyde. 91 overall ground and pound style, 6 foot tall, 92 speed, 89 agility, 92 ball carry, 88 juke, 96 truck, 93 carry, 94 excel, and 86 elusiveness. Also has a 72 catch and a 91 stiff form. The guy is definitely a great power back, but anyways man, enough talking, let me show you what he can do. So campus here with Carlos Hyde man, you can definitely juke with this guy, you can spin with this guy, but I feel the best way to use him of course is running up the middle and just taking advantage of that stiff arm and truck now he's not the tallest running back but he's just stocky you know and that's why I feel that he falls forward more often than not as you can see here this is one of the best ways to use him run up the middle let him get you those few extra yards out. let me look at that just fighting as best he can to get those few extra yards and right here just falling forward for an extra one or two yards himself and right here he's definitely one of those backs man where you can throw to him in the flats and not you know worry about him dropping the ball but don't test it in traffic I did a couple times it did not pay off so only throw it to him if you see that he's got a nice, you know, clear open space to catch it. This right here definitely will break tackles on his own, you know. Not as often, you know, as say Marshawn Lynch or anything, but definitely solid enough, you know, for his, um, you know, like his going price. Now, I would say the best way to use him would be the same way. Oh, and this as well. Definitely took about maybe three or four hit six, zero fumbles, but that does not mean he won't fumble. But anyways, like I was saying, um... The best way to use him would be the same way to use that, that 99 Marshawn Lynch. And that would be running up the middle and playing safe. He's definitely not fast. You know, that's the one, th the one thing that holds him back. So, don't expect him to break many 50 or 60 yard runs. Not that he can't do it. Just saying don't expect it too often because he will get chased down. Now, this right here is the best way to use him by abusing the stiff arm like that right there and the trucking. Now, like I said, if you want to bounce to the outside, you absolutely can. But the thing is, I think the best way is to run up the middle. That's how you can get the most yards. And like I was saying, even though I'm comparing him to Marshawn Lynch, I'm not saying that he's just as good or break, um, will break as many tackles. I'm just saying that you should definitely use them the same. So you always want to truck and lean forward or the stiff arm. Just help you kick, look at those few extra yards like this right here. Let me look at that. That play was dead. He broke the stiff arm and then pushed those guys for an extra few or four yards. And I'm going to end this review with this play right here. Now it looks great and everything, running past these guys, he's even going to break this tackle coming up, but that 92 speed holds him back and Sean Taylor does chase him down at the end. Anyways guys, that's going to be the end of this review. My final thoughts, do I think he's worth 30000 You know what man, that sounds like a great price. He's absolutely a top 5 budget back, whether or not you look at him as a budget back or a top 5 budget power back, it does not matter man, the guy is absolutely a beast on the field. Now you can use him if you're still rising up in the ranks or even if you're already at the top of the ranks he's a great relief back to bring in when you're starting running back gets tired i absolutely recommend uh, trying out carlos hyde but anyways guys that's gonna be, be the end of that man my next review should be the ultimate legend um terrell suggs so be on the lookout for that now see y'all boys later man peace